What is going on you guys, it's Lobo here, and I got you guys something special. So I'm pretty sure you guys already know by the thumbnail and the title. I guess I ended up upgrading to the PS4 Pro. Shout out to my girlfriend. She actually got this for me because, um, that, I, I don't know. I guess she loves me that much. And, uh, yeah, dude. So I, I was pretty caught off guard by this, but thank you so much. It means a lot. Love you. But anyways, PS4 Pro. So I've been wanting one for the longest. You guys know me. Recently switched over to the PS4 for the sake of Call of Duty. And, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to unboxing it. But I did get one more thing because we ended up going to GameStop. I got this. So I didn't know exactly what this was, but this is basically like a PS4 um, crate in a sense. And it's got a bunch of things inside. So I also wanted to unbox this with you guys, but uh, I'm pretty sure you guys are more interested in the PS4 Pro. So we'll get to this later. So uh, first things first, let's uh, open this up. So uh, yeah, this is the first time I've ever gotten something like this. Well, technically a second, but uh, I'm pretty curious to see how it turns out. It feels a lot bigger and heavier. So here it is. I want to be super careful. I want to drop it. Ooh. Well, not too bad. It does feel a bit heavier. Not that much. Oh, if you guys couldn't tell. So right here on the bottom, uh, it's got the little shapes. The triangle, the circle, the X, the square, and the logo. It's a little, really, uh, little neat touch that they added. Not bad. This also came inside of it. You got two stickers. Pretty sure if you guys could see that. Got a clear one and the original color one for the emblem. One of the main things, PS4 Pro controller. And two special about that it's just a standard controller oh pretty neat. feels nice so we got the cables and uh yeah let's uh let's set this up a few moments later so this is all taking a lot longer than expected and it was a huge hassle to get the playstation at this point for me to install it so what it says right here it's transferring the data from my old ps4 to my new one and as you can see it says three hours left but luckily for you guys that'll be soon enough but the reason why i'm telling you guys all this is because i won't be able to do the other unboxing uh, with the light since it's gonna be dark by the time this is done. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna unbox the other box real quick and then uh, we'll see what happens from there. Stay tuned. All right, so let's get to unboxing this and uh, we'll see what happens. We'll look at that later. Ooh, let's put this down. So we actually have a snapback from PlayStation. So it's got the logo with the blue bill, not too bad. Now, while I was at GameStop, I actually picked up another hat. So. Is what it looks like it's just another snapback with a silver emblem and yeah it's got a nice touch to it i don't wear snapbacks with the bill to the front if it's a snapback i'll wear it backwards like how you guys saw in the other video that i uploaded so not too bad they're both decent hats all right so next things next is that we have this it's a blanket i think it is a blanket yeah it's a blanket <clears throat> oh look at it you guys see it Maybe okay you guys can see the emblem, PlayStation logo with a bunch of controllers, different colors, each representing one of the buttons. This is pretty neat. I like it. It's a, oh, it was actually backwards. There you go. So that's the correct way. It's the PlayStation logo and the controllers. So pretty neat. So nice little blanket. Uh, pretty sure I'm going to end up using it. Next thing's next is this. Again, I'm sorry for the glare, guys, but you guys know how it is. So they're actually coasters. So if we take a better look at them, here's the triangle, here's the circle, here's a square, like me. <laughs> And here's the X. So nice. Uh, the last time I had coasters like this was actually for Black Ops 4. I mean, Black Ops 3, I have them somewhere. They're actually pretty nice. Uh, I have my wolf coaster on the on the desk. Uh, cool. Anyways, next thing's next. What is this? Oh, I think, wait, I think I know what this is. So you put it like so, hands through here, and bam. It's kind of like a scarf. So yeah. So this is, uh, it says the product is from Culturefly. That's what this little thing was. It was just like, uh, kind of like a promotion. Oh, you know, let us know, oh, get some feedback. You'll get 50% off your next order. Anyways, pretty cool. Oh, we got this. PlayStation Collector's Mug. I like mugs. So here it is. Just a simple little mug. Not bad, pretty nice. So decent little mug for your coffee or your tea or whatever you want to use it for. Again, by Culturefly. So you can see it. So not bad. It's pretty nice. And here we have vinyl controller art. Huh. Huh. Look at that. So it's a uh, little controller. It's a model after the very first one from the first PlayStation. So anyone who's anyone uh, that's played PlayStation ever since they were younger. So might bring a little bit of nostalgia. Obviously, you don't see the analog sticks. I don't know why, but it's pretty neat. Not bad. Oh. So this is actually a, so this is a messenger bag. So it's pretty small. I think it should have some straps in here. Yeah. Yeah, it's got the strap in here. It's got a couple pockets. So not too bad. Oh, it's pretty neat. So not bad, pretty cool. 
And here we have a lanyard. Hmm. As you guys can see, it's got the emblem, the logo, the shapes, and if you guys look closely, it's a little blurry, but you guys can see it. It's a little controller but that, uh, that comes with this. So it's pretty nice. So not bad. I actually like this. It. It's pretty neat. And uh, I'm actually surprised this comes in here, but there's even a PlayStation controller bath mat. So this is pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Um, I never expected to see that. Uh, a bath mat of a controller. If anything, I'll just put this near my bed so I can step on it when I walk out because I'm pretty sure I'm not going to use this in my bathroom. But yeah, PlayStation controller bath mat. Nice. And last but not least, uh, we actually have a pin that comes in here. So, bam, PlayStation 1 pin. So, if you guys didn't notice, there's a little notch right here at the top. So, it's kind of an open it. So, we're going to see what that's all, all about. So, if we flip it, kind of what the inside looks like. Uh, just like a regular little port for your uh, for your discs from back in the day. That's what it looks like. So, pretty neat. Not bad. Not bad at all. So, yeah, that, that's pretty much it for this little unboxing. Yeah. So, anyways, uh, that's that for that unboxing. Gonna put that away. And uh, we'll hop straight into uh, how the PS4 Pro looks. So, hopefully we'll be done by then. So, stay tuned. Alright, so it's all done. And it took quite a while, actually. I mean... Man, this took a lot longer than I expected. But like I said, it's finally dark now that this is finally done. So from what I'm seeing, guys, uh, like I said, uh, it does look... And everything looks a bit sharper when it comes down to colors and whatnot. But I mean... Ooh. Eventually. We lost by two, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so that's gonna be the video for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, yeah, it's been, this was quite a hassle, but you know, we got it done and yeah, we got the PS4 Pro. So far, uh, I don't see much of a difference at the moment. The only thing is that the everything looks sharper, it runs a little better. You can see the difference between the frame rates and all that, so that's pretty cool. Like I said, if you guys are interested in upgrading, it's a nice upgrade. Uh, there's slight differences here and there, but it's all up to whoever's gonna buy them. But yeah, so that's gonna be it. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys have any ideas for us, be sure to let us know down below in the comment section. Also, I will be bringing the league play, you know, which is this. You know, I'll, I'll be doing that probably tomorrow or within the next two days because it does end on, in two days for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know why it's so short, or maybe I'm just reading it wrong. But anyways, uh, be sure to keep an eye out for that. Also, as well as other games like Resident Evil 2, God of War, and um, you know, The Last of Us. You know, be sure to keep an eye out for that. And yeah, so it's been love, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Later.